we take a look at a forecast out there. Beautiful start. Oh, look at this. It's pretty, just a few high clouds in the sky. A lovely start to our day. The lake is a bit calmer than it was a few days ago, and we're looking at a pretty good setup. This is not good. This is heavy rains creating massive floods in Baltimore. This is not our area, but Baltimore dealing with a similar setup to what we're still dealing with along many of our areas area rivers. They had some very, very heavy rain too. Part and parcel of the same system that rolled through here, bringing that energy on off to the east coast. So they're, they're cleaning up and dealing with that uh, same sort of situation. The Fox River along Algonquin uh, currently at 12.36. It's in a prolonged cresting event. Um, it's probably going to get up to about 12.4, but it's essentially at the crest now. It's been there though for a while and will continue to be there. Flood stage is nine and a half feet. We're looking at a radar picture showing dry conditions right now. We do have an air quality alert though for our counties over in northwest Indiana. You may want to stay indoors today if you have any kind of breathing or ref respiratory issues. We have future cast showing dry conditions, but all that heat, all that humidity really building up today and eventually we'll start to see some showers and storms more so tomorrow than today. And that trend will continue into the weekend. We have that heat locked down to the south and west. It's going to infiltrate up around here as well, but the advice advisories and the watches and warnings are all down to the south and west of us where temperatures will be well up into the 90s places like St. Louis and Kansas City. We're going to be topping out around 88, but it will feel like the 90s today getting tropical out there about 88 degrees. The high temperature seven day planner takes us out. Highs uh, likely to be somewhere in the mid to upper 80s uh, pretty much across the board and we're going to add that chance of showers and storms a little bit more potent going into the end of the work week, Derek.